well Asai Dokubo has waded into rivers matter again what is he saying what does he have to say uh he is accusing Tinubu of celebrating the 27 rivers lawmakers today they said they have not decamped according to Asari Dokubo a well-known figure in the Calabari kingdom named Asari Dokubo has expressed his worries about a court decision concerning 27 legislators in Nigeria in river state who have claimed to have switched from the PDP to the APC Recall that a court in River State recently ruled that the lawmakers continued to be PDP members. <laughs> of course, when I heard a uh, lot of uh, PDP or APC supporters who are saying, Yes, they did not decamp. I say, But you guys were celebrating it. Oh, that uh, they were smart. They are this. That is to tell you that uh, the same lawmakers and the people who are behind them, who is a uh, uh, who happens to be Wiki and Sinumbu, they don't have integrity. What is his name? Wicked, I will tell you today that uh, how can you say you want to say uh, that Nigeria should not vote for a uh, APC or somebody like uh, Tinubu who said he wants to continue from uh, where Buari stops? That continue from where? Continue from hardship? Continue for this? God forbid that he join APC, that he prefers to be in PDP because the PDP problem is is you know is easy to solve. They have problems, of course, which I agree to the fact that there's a problem in PDP, but it is very easy to manage on compared or compared to unlike uh, what um is obtainable in APC. He said many, many, many things. Oh God forbid he does not want to be minister, minister for what? What does he want again in his life? D -d 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 -d. At the end of the day, we can see the kind of person he is. Yo, is it Tinubu that has that integrity? So what are you talking about? And those who are supporting them, they do not have integrity, but they are the ones that will come and begin to point fingers. Oh, these people are not good, these people are not uh, that and they are worse off. So after celebrating them, you now come back and you say they did not decamp. And you are saying yes, it's usually they did not decamp. That say you want to just hear near listen. You want, you are just saying uh, you want to bring evidence just near social media declaration. That is what that's what people are talking about. Like seriously. So what why is it that they have not been sitting? Because as far as I know, it is not the government of the state that said they are no longer in a uh, PDP. So why is it that uh, the ones that are still in PDP, they never decamped, they never said they decamped, and they are the ones who have been functioning? Why is it that the 27 lawmakers have not been functioning, if really they are still in PDP? Well, this is a, 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 a point which, of course, we have been saying, well, of course, which is still coming from uh, Asai Dokubo. In a video Asai Dokubo shared on his Facebook page, he said that uh, when the lawmakers announced their defection to the APC, Tinubu celebrated them, only for them to now say they never decamped or they never left PDP. He questioned whether this situation aligns with the principles of democracy, which Tinubu and others fought for. Hey, hey. You can imagine that uh, all of them, you just have to stand by what you are, what you know and the truth that you know. Even if people do not even accept the truth, maybe you are on, they think that you are on the wrong side because people you always join the bandwagon. They will say this and that. But they know that they are not saying the truth because no matter what, the truth will be there. And those who are standing by the truth, they will continue to be on the side of the truth. Even if you are saying the truth and later you say you don't want to say the truth again, the truth will, will still come back and make that truth there. And that is exactly what is happening um, to, what is this guy's name? Asayu Dokubo. Is it not the same Asayu Dokubo that was all over the place? Say, he will do anything for Tinubu. But because he was looking for something, Nigerians are are crying but they will tell you that they don't mind them the same as i do but don't mind those people who are always talking about it you know, because their candidates did not win we say like seriously now it's not telling us about a democracy in, in in my own opinion they don't have integrity both we kill both uh, Tinubu, they have no integrity so now it is now that asai dokubo is now asking that question whether the situation aligns with the principles of democracy which Tinubu and others fought for in Asai Dokubo ways, you celebrated them, the 27 lawmakers, rivers lawmakers, that you can't reject them. And today, they said they have not decamped. Is this the democracy you fought for? Is this the June 12th you fought for? No bad song. <laughs> okay. Mm. This is your matter. Eh? <laughs> Tinubu has nothing to help Nigeria. He has nothing to offer Nigeria. There is no hope in Nigeria. I only pity the children yet unborn. We have lost everything. How can group of politicians decamp with joy? Celebrated with Mr. President Tinubu now deny being decamp. I pity Nigeria. 
see eh, the issue of eh, oh the unborn children you see the way we are taking a lot of things just like eh, the way our forefathers were seeing issues is different from the way we are we this generation are seeing things and that's why they are so uncomfortable with the youth of today the ones that are coming after us eh, they, they might not even be able to try rubbish if you do any harm you see any harm so you should see let uh, tomorrow let tomorrow take care of itself those ones uh, they just like the way we are uh, accusing the our own fathers our forefathers that uh, you didn't do well you were so quiet this and that it is not like that today because people are challenging the authority they are challenging the status quo and that's why they are so uncomfortable they are so ag agitated when they hear some people talk about it so don't even worry don't bother about uh, the unborn generation because those ones were they will change the narrative because we can't we can continue we are still like okay we see talks more we still try to try to be reasonable or try, try to be patient not be reasonable but don't worry about the new generation they will take care of the situation themselves well that is why a wise man will think twice before saying if tinubu fails hold me responsible exactly same atari dogo <laughs> you know they think but all boils down to the fact that in the look for what he wants, as he no can't get her, he can't get to say the truth. Which the truth, the truth he left is coming back to that truth. It is the nature of dogs to swallow their own vomit. A faith praise singer of yesterday would turn back to be a critic of today. Beware of some of infrastructural praise singers. It is the nature of dogs. Yes, useless days will be. You are part of the problem of this country. You were supporting APC propagandists. Yeah. <laughs> don't, you don't need to insult him. Because he said he insulted him. That is it. He said he insulted people. Um, one thing again is that uh, there is technicality in every profession. Only those in the field we know. Not as ordinary person think. Law is the most difficult profession in the sense that it sets parameters and still allow the judges use their initiatives at times so don't even blame judges they are only using the tools in law this guy is seriously looking for attention from the government please can this government help him they can't help him forget because of uh, the way they have disappointed him uh -huh. he said they do gala gala they do gra gra somebody will say she will say they do gala gala they do gra gra yeah, somebody will say gala gala somebody will say gra gra what you think now gara gara you they use that be na gala gala you they do gala gala you they do gara gara you they, they, they give her for us to rock you they, they, they address say guy hey they did it i say <laughs> see eh all of now eh we we they feel bad now eh leave the wiki open to you we now today <laughs> leave all of them all the buhala and eh uh, ffk and eh uh, reno they will come back and eat they will use their mouth eh, to scrub ground. Oh my fear, no one bully. That their mouth eh, they will use to scrub ground. That their mouth eh, they will say they say for their life. They know they want to get integrity. Oh my goodness, that's their mouth eh, they will use to rub ground. Do they say they talk any house? Eh? Don't just bother leave them because they are on the wrong side. They are on the wrong side, so they will still come back. We know the stuff they are made of now, but because of what they want, it is glaring, it is stinking, it is. You know, even the the, the 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 blind can even see the the road they are playing. You know that the road they are playing is not genuine. Don't even bother about them. They are just lost souls. So lost souls. If you don't want to stay on the path of the truth, it's going to boomerang against you. I was telling somebody that said, you know what? For the fact that you think that say, oh, you some things maybe you are okay, you are a bit okay, then the rest people should be bound to the Philistines. That is not how life is. No matter how. How, how comfortable you are for you to know somebody who has the feelings of the people you are very very comfortable but you are not you are not okay with the situation of things because you are seeing many people around you that are not making it that are crying but for the fact that you have that a uh, little privilege you don't think that they don't just think that everybody mm, maybe they are so lazy or this and that or you know concern you now they know it could be you what do you think say you get today if you don't get them again tomorrow and if we continue to think in that direction that it's none of my business, it's none of my business, after all, I'm okay. It is not a good thing. I don't like such people around me. I don't like such people around me. If you think that uh, you are okay in the kind of Nigeria setting that we are, we have, if you go up with your mind, mind no go reach ground because you are going to be the target. 
that is even if if you don't even have it that sympathy that they're oh it could have been me that i mean in this situation that the things are not working with but if you don't want to think in that line but think in it uh, uh, in another bed that you could be a target because everybody will be the they vest they only use a chop people never chop you come here come here come here come here do gra gra do you don't go get rest of mind so people are always thinking when you see people who in the face of a in the face of this nonsense that we are experiencing they will not say the truth they will still be supporting the evil just because they are benefiting so you that are you are not a, you are not part of them or you are not benefiting they would they would they, they don't even care for you they don't even have sympathy no sympathy whatsoever i don't like such people around me and that is the kind of a buhala and the people you are seeing that are defending the indefensible they are not nice people so guys uh, let's know what you think and have your take on this thank you